Hey, Colette this hey, welcome back guys. Welcome back. Shout out to the entire YouTube fam. Shout out to everyone that has booked a personal reading guys. Everybody that has donated, okay? Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate the love and the support guys. We have solitude here on the bottom, okay? Some of you guys, I feel like, could be coming from out of isolation, okay? Uh, some of you could definitely be in that hermit energy, but I'm picking up on this is the season that you are, again, coming, yes, out of isolation, guys. Beautiful energies here. Miracles with change. What is it that the collective need to know? Whoa. So this is a lot. I'm just, I'm not going to take them, okay? <laughs> it's a lot going on. Which is a great thing. I like when a lot of energies come out. Wow, there we go. We have change. It came back out, guys, with openness. You need to be open to some sort of change here, collective. Wow, this is dope energies, guys. You need to be open to some sort of change. Yeah, we have enlightenment. We have enlightenment, guys. I feel like this is, what did I say? A season where you are coming from out of isolation, okay? Uh, this could be a season or a period of enlightenment for you, okay? I'm also picking up with openness here, collective. This is something that your spirit needs to be open to. You need to be open to uh, any change at this time. I'm also picking up... Um, I'm also picking up with openness here. Um, be still, okay? Be still. So thank you, Holy Spirit. This is taking me back to, what did I say? Something about isolation, okay? Be open to receiving signs, okay? But you must be still, collective, okay? Do nothing. Be open, okay? Okay? You have the ability to incubate your dreams for the future collective. If you're trying to make a decision, okay, take the time to watch for signs, okay? And listen uh, to the whispers of the universe. Listen to the whispers of God collective. Watch your dream messages as well, okay? Regarding... Uh, the situation that you're needing answers on or the situation that you are seeking, um, yeah, answers about. Uh, openness also talks about miracles being able to show up in ways that you did not expect. Thank you, Holy Spirit, because we saw miracles and we saw change um, while I was shuffling the deck. So it was meant for us to see that miracle card. Wow, there's a miracle that somebody is about to get. I feel like there's a big blessing, like your life is about to change with change and openness here. With openness here, there is nothing else that you need to do. This is something that is already yours, collective. Wow. Oh, um, I'm also picking up, you know, the moon is here. The moon is here, okay? Um, it's kind of like, um, something sacred is going is, is gonna happen here with openness. Okay. Because we see the moon, we see like kind of like constellations here. Um, this card speaks about, uh, and hopefully this is not TMI. I shouldn't even really apologize for this in advance, but um, you know, the let's talk about the moon cycles really quick okay the cycles of the moon literally collective uh affect every aspect of our life okay uh the moon also affects well it is said to affect uh monthly cycles of women right um
when we have the full moon, when we have the new moon, okay, the different moons that we have, like, supposed to affect uh, a woman's menstrual cycle, right? I'm taking y'all somewhere. Just bear with me, right? This is what I'm saying. It's something sacred, collective, that is about to happen here with change and openness. There is some sort of secret, uh, secrets of the moon, okay? There is some sort of secret surrounding this change. Uh, there is a seat, some sort of secret surrounding what is about to take place collective, okay? I'm also picking up uh, with change here, okay? Um, I definitely feel like it's okay to change your mind about something, right? It's okay to uh, reevaluate things, to change directions, okay? Um, I feel like now is the time. It's very important, Collective, that you put, uh, let's just say, like, p other people's needs and other people's expectations of you. Uh, you have to put this aside, Okay. Beat to your own drum with change here. Beat to your own drum, collective. Walk to your own pace, okay? Create your own traditions, okay? You don't need to follow tradition here. I feel like you are free uh, to express yourself, okay? You're free to let your spirit fly, collective, with change and openness here. I'm also hearing be unpredictable, okay? Be unpredictable. I feel like something unpredictable could be uh could happen here. What else is it that the collective needs to know? Yeah, we got stand still, wow, and we have going forward, wow, guys. Wow. Because I talked about isolation, okay? And this is what this stand still is giving me. Something could have been stagnant, or I'm not really picking up a stagnant here, but it's kind of like something has not been moving forward, okay? Again, kind of like uh, picking up um, a hermit energy. Maybe you were just isolated, um, receiving downloads, or, you know, pouring into yourself, okay? But something is picking up. We have go going forward here. There's about to be a shift. There's about to be a shift. Uh, if there was something that has been stagnant, co collective, okay? Uh, it's about to pick up. Something is about to pick up for, for somebody here. Let's get one more. I feel like you could have been placed in hermit energy also, right? Because there was some sort of change again that God already knew was coming. So a lot of times we God had to place us in isolation, put us in hermit energy so we can be still. So that we can be still. Wow, but going forward, collective, there's about to be some sort of a sacred change is what I'm picking up on. Be open to this change, collective. Uh, you may have to take a leap of faith. You may have to take some sort of risk here. Wow, we have gateway uh, with potential here. There's a door that's opening for you. There is a door that is opening for you. You you are full of potential, collective. Wow. This is dope energy. You are full of potential, collective. I'm also picking up with... Um, I'm also picking up with, with standstill here, okay? Uh, okay, no. I'm thinking about uh, the word stillness, okay? But no, standstill. Um... Something has was not progressing, but but like I said, I feel like God placed you in a situation where you had to be still. 
okay? Maybe this was a period of your life collective where you had a test. You had a test. Maybe your finances wasn't right. Maybe your, your living situation wasn't right, okay? Maybe your job situation wasn't right, okay? You could have been dealing with a lot of issues here. Something, uh, again, uh, was taking place that was causing you not to progress, causing you not to move forward. But God placed you in this situation because he was preparing this door to be open for you. Something about potential here is standing out. I'm also picking up collective uh, with going forward here, okay? Again, yeah, going forward and gateway. It's like a path. You're being divinely led, collective, like down a certain road, down a certain path, uh, in a certain industry, You're about to, I'm hearing perfect opportunity. There's about to be some sort of perfect opportunity uh, for you collective. I also feel like um, with going forward here, okay? This card is, uh, this is giving me, um, let me see what card, what energy would... This is kind of giving me uh, Empress energy, okay? And let me tell you why. Because going forward, this card often talks about fertility. This card talks about productivity, love, health, abundance, fulfillment here. You, you have all of these things moving forward, collective. Something is growing. Something is expanding in your life at this time, okay? I feel like you definitely need to keep putting one foot forward here. I also feel like sometimes it may be uh, easy to uh, become distracted, okay, by what's happening around us, okay? But I feel like it's important for you not to let anything hold you back, okay? Wow, there is something amazing that is about to happen, collective. Wow, literally amazing. Uh, I don't know, something great is happening here. Because we saw change uh, while we were shuffling, remember? So for, so for it to come back out is something significant surrounding change here. I'm definitely picking up major arcana energy. This is something you could definitely be manifesting collective. I'm also picking up uh, with gateway here, okay? There is some sort of magic, okay? A unicorn is here. Some of you guys maybe have connections with uh, unicorns possibly. But I'm picking up with this collective. Um, it's much easier for you to manifest your dreams at this time, okay? This is an excellent time to take action on your visions for your future, okay? Let's clarify with some tarot. Yeah, because again, potential is here at the bottom. Somebody is about to reach their fullest potential. This is this change. You are about to reach your fullest potential. All right, let's see. Why is uh, change here? Wow, we got the page of cups with everything is fine wow so i feel like it's nothing for you to be worried about collective okay it's nothing for you to be worried about i feel like with everything is fine here something may have ended okay for you to start over or for you to start anew okay i'm also picking up um with with the page of cups here collective okay this could be an exciting new opportunity that's going to present itself to you, okay? Uh, you need to be open to receiving some sort of communication. Thank you, Holy Spirit. You're going to receive some sort of message with the Page of Cups here from an unexpected source, okay? Uh, this could also be your own intuition, but this is something in the physical realm that I'm picking up on. This is not 
a spiritual download that you're going to receive. This is a message in the physical realm that you are going to see, uh, receive. This is going to propel uh, you forward in some sort of way. Whatever communication this is that you receive, uh, this is the beginning of you collective reaching your fullest potential, okay? You will reach your fullest potential. But again, I feel like th this something uh, significant about stand still. I feel like in this uh, season here, uh, some of you guys could have been doing your shadow work. You could have been doing some soul searching, okay? You could have been unlearning and relearning collective. But again, there's definitely some sort of message uh, that you should be expecting. Somebody should be expecting uh, communication. Why is Gateway here? Why is the gateway here? Wow, this is a lot. These came out too. Uh, we got four. I'm not going to take all these. Why is the gateway here? Wow, with the Empress. And what did I say? This going forward card, this is kind of Empress energy, fertility, uh, love. This is manifesting energy. You're manifesting some collective. We got the fool card. You're about to begin some sort of new journey here. This may require you taking a risk, okay? It may require you uh, taking a leap of faith collective. But there is a door that is about to open, uh, for somebody. This could be a divine feminine energy with the Empress here. Something is changing. There's about to be a major shift. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yeah, what did I say with stand still? In this period of isolation, in this hermit energy, you went through a rebirth. Somebody went through, through the rebirth and you came out here as the Empress, okay? Now this door uh, is, is opening for you. I'm hearing... um. Your ancestral inheritance is being extended to you. Your ancestral inheritance collective is about to be extended to you. Wow, this is beautiful energies, guys. Something you've been working long and hard at here is about to pay off, okay? So I hope this message resonated, guys. If it did, please hit that like button, okay? Don't forget to subscribe if you would like to book a personal reading. Uh, the information will be in the description below. Thank you guys so much for watching.